kids, and welcome back. We've been waiting so much to spend some time with you again. Now, these are the videos where we are going to discover the mysteries of science through experiments. Remember, it's not rocket science. It's just Mr. Robert's science. So kids, today we are going to experiment with eggs. We are going to change their color. We are going to change their size. We are going to change their consistency and final their resistance. Now, how are we gonna do that? Well, we're gonna do that through a chemical reaction. Now, in, these, in this phase, we are gonna be doing a lot of experiments that you can do at home without having to go outside. But as soon as this COVID-19 phase finishes, we will be able to go outside and we have a bunch of experiments that we want to do with you. Now, you might also have some ideas for us. So don't hesitate. Write down in the comments below and we will try doing the experiments that you suggest. Now, are you ready? It's time to start the experiment. Step number one. What you need is you need vinegar. Vinegar is going to be the acid. Then the second thing that you need is an egg. What is going to happen? The acidity of the vinegar is going to melt completely all of the calcium inside the eggshell. Now, let's get cracking. Well, how do we start the experiment? What do we need? We need a container. I suggest a glass container so that you can observe the transformation and how the experiment progresses because this experiment will take 24 hours before it's completely finished. We're going to put vinegar inside our glass container. Rosa, can you open the vinegar please? Thank you. Go ahead and pour it inside. Then, after we've poured the vinegar inside our container, we take our egg and gently, without cracking it, we place it inside. The egg has to be completely covered. And then we set it down and we wait. Okay, so, so we have let our egg rest inside a jar with vinegar for 24 hours. What we notice immediately is that the shell is completely melted away. Another thing that we notice is that the egg's consistency isn't hard anymore, but it's more rubbery. Another cool thing that you can see is that now light shine straight through it, showing us what's inside the egg. Isn't that amazing? What we're going to do now is we're going to take this egg and put it back inside the vinegar with a little bit of food coloring. We're going to choose two different colors for the two eggs. As you can see in this jar here, we still have our egg inside the vinegar. You can see all the reaction that's happening, all those bubbles is the acid of the vinegar eating away the shell of our egg. Once you take the egg out, it's good to pass it gently under some water because that allows you to take away all the final residues that are on the external layer of the egg. Now we're gonna put it inside with a little bit of food coloring, let it rest, and it's gonna change color.
So as you see, we have our two eggs drained of all of the coloring solution. Here we have a blue egg, and here we have our red egg. Now let's take them out of the jar and let's look a little bit closer to what has happened. What we can see is that the shell is completely gone. The shell that made the egg hard has now dissolved and the egg is soft and squishy. Wow, that's interesting. Let's have a look at the red egg. And we can notice that the same thing has happened to the red egg. It's squishy. And as you notice, we can also see some light pass through it. Now it's time to put the eggs to the test. Let's see how resistant they are. And we are gonna do that with a very interesting stress test. Are you ready? Now, children, we've made it to the point in the experiment in which we analyze the result of our experiments. We saw that the eggs now were softer, that they are a little rubbery. What is the difference between these eggs and a normal egg? Well, a normal egg has a hard shell. Let's see what happens if you stress test an egg by dropping it on a hard surface. As you see, the egg cracks because the shell is hard and rigid. It doesn't have any room to bounce and to move. Now let's see what happens with one of our eggs. We're gonna start with the red egg first. With the red egg first. Do you see children? The egg bounces. Wow. bounces much more than a normal egg. Normal eggs, at the first try, dropping them on a hard surface, crack. Let's try with the second egg. Wow, did you see? It took them many bounces to crack. Okay, children, and that is the magic of playing with science. Remember, it's not rocket science, it's just Mr. Robert's science.